No time to lose! I'm feeling empty. I'm gonna quickly show you how to use the Outline Helper add-on for Blender 2.8. First, download the add-on. Link to its Gumroad page is in the description. Simply type in a zero into the price if you would like to get the add-on for free. Install it like any other Blender add-on and you should find a new tab in the sidebar called Outline Helper. Create a model and give it a material, then select the object and press Add Set Outline. Ta-da! A new outline has been added and you can adjust it in the little operator window down there. You can do that with multiple objects at the same time. If your object already has an outline, the button only adjusts the outline, it won't add another one. Adjust Outline does exactly the same, except it doesn't add an outline if the object doesn't have one. Useful if you just want to adjust all outlines without having to select your objects individually. And Remove Outline, well, that's what it says on the tin. The Outline Helper is non-destructive. It uses the solidify modifier and materials to generate the inverted hull outlines and keeps track of them through their names, so try not to rename them or the functionality of the add-on will break. The outline material needs to be always the last material on the list, so keep that in mind if you add more. When selecting multiple outline objects and then setting or adjusting the outline, all outlines will be adjusted to the same thickness as the last selected object. Also, outlines only work on meshes and curves with geometry, so the add-on won't try to add outlines to other things like cameras and lights. For future updates on this add-on, I would like to add vertex group and edit mode support to give you more control over the outline thickness per vertex. If you have any other suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comments. Alright, I hope this will be useful to you. I'd like to thank Curtis Holt for encouraging me to write this add-on, as well as Blender NPR to keep me motivated. A link to their channels are in the description. If you would like to follow my work, you can subscribe to my channel, as well as follow me on Twitter. See you next time, bye!